Hey guys, so I'm going to be trying to do um, daily webcam vlogs um, for as long as I can because um, I enjoy doing it and I feel like you guys get to know me a lot better. And um, yeah, so I'm going to try to do the family vlogs again. I'm just, uh, my memory card is out of memory and I was in the process of loading it on my computer, my memory card, and um, it only um, got 35 items or, you know, things off my memory card. And now my computer's out of memory, so now that means I have to, you know, delete memory off my, well, I have to put memory onto my external hard drive and then delete off my hard drive, on my computer hard drive. So after I do all that, my memory card will be empty again, hopefully. So then I'll try my best to make family vlogs. Uh, I just don't like my editing program. It sucks. If you guys know, I'm a, and I cannot use movies, I cannot use Windows Movie Maker because my camera's not compatible with it. I used to love using Movies Movie Maker um, before I got this camera, which I got this camera in April of 2011. So that sucks. I could do the webcam video. I can actually edit the webcam videos with Movies Movie Maker, which I should have done that the night when. Well, I was just trying to mess around with my new web with my new editing software. But that 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 took way too long. The editing software that my husband got me is like confusing. It's still Sony Vegas, but I don't think I like Sony Vegas anymore. At least not the one I got because it's not very good. So if you guys know of any kind of good editing software under 50 bucks, 50 or and under, let me know what that is. Like it has to be kind of simple because I'm a little bit retarded. So um, you know I'm a beginner, so it has to be what 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 beginners can use. So anyways, um, what was I talking about? I don't even. Know. So I'm gonna start doing. What webcam vlogs every day if I have time, if I have enough me time. Right now I'm in the process of doing laundry. Um, Savannah had a blowout last night. I don't know if I mentioned it in my video from last night. But I, yeah, it was a big blowout and she got multiple things messed up, or dirty, pooped on, in her bass, in her bass, and I keep saying bass in it, in her playpen. So, um, yeah, I have been washing these I've been, it's like my third time washing it. So after this, I have to wash my daughter's school clothes. So I'm going to get to bed late. Um, Savannah just fell asleep a little bit ago. It was a crazy night. Um, she's been pretty bad. But yeah, I just got to making like a five minute video talking about Savannah's blowout from last night and talking about how she had a blowout, a blowout tonight, but I caught it in time for she wouldn't make a mess because she did a sneaky last night. She usually grunts when she poops. But yesterday she did not. And I'm right here and I put her in the uh, playpen, which is right next to my bed. And, but she, I don't know how she did it, magically got poop everywhere without getting poop on her hands. I, I don't know how they do it. Those kids are weird. Not weird, but kids are amazing how they can do stuff. And she was only in there for like three minutes. And she did a big old poop and got it, got made a big mess. Anyways, that's enough about Santa's poop. She did poop tonight, but I knew that she was going to do it in there without grunting. So I had my eyes on her, and I was prepared for it, and it did not, she did not leak, so that's good. My daughter is already in size 6. Uh, my Ch Savannah, Cheyenne, Cheyenne. Cheyenne's in size 6 diapers. No, Savannah is in size 6 diapers already. My child is like 30 pounds, not even joking. She is a big girl. She's heavy. Anyways, um, so kind of wanted just to tell you, I like doing these videos because I feel like you guys could, I feel like you guys are getting to know me more. And I was very shy in front of the camera for a long time. Um, and this is like, um, I guess I feel weird, I guess, talking about certain things on this channel. I, I always, I kind of always feel kind of weird or awkward. Since this channel was like a pregnancy channel of mine, you know, that's how I started out making pregnancy vlogs. So I feel like it's more of a family channel. That's like the category people have me under is the family channel. So, well, I don't know if I should make a new channel because some people do have two channels, you know, one for mommy vlogs and one for themselves. Well, I don't want this just to be a family mommy channel. I want it to be a me channel too, you know, and sometimes I cuss and I don't want to feel guilty for, you know, spitting out a cuss word, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, you guys let me know. I mean, I know most of you guys are adults, so you guys, 
You guys technically shouldn't care. I know. You guys heard cuss words before. I'm sure you guys cuss too. So, I don't know. It's just in the back of my head, I feel very guilty for, for I don't know, talking about certain things and, you know, or saying certain things. But I am a person that cusses. I'm not going to lie. You know, like, I don't try to cuss in front of my kids, but it will, I will sometimes, you know, which is not a good habit, but hey. I'm not perfect. I'm not trying to be perfect. Um, well, I, you know, I, well, I'm biting my own words. I do try to be perfect. Well, you know, I try to be the best person I can be. And I try to be the best role model and mother that I can be. And obviously, if I'm over there spitting out cuss words left and right, that wouldn't be very proper to me. So, I do try my best, you know, but at the end of the day, I'm still me. And I'm still my own person and I still you know talk a certain way and I was brought up a certain way unfortunately and you know we live in a, a world that cusses so of course I spit fire sometimes you know that that's just me um but I kinda wanted to talk to you guys about I, I mean I, I say the weirdest words in the world like I come up with the I'm the most goofiest weirdo you'll ever meet. Like, seriously, I really am. And you guys probably don't even think I'm the way I really am in life because I don't really express that. And I want to start expressing who I am and talk in my mumble jumble because I do have a mumble. I do talk in a certain jumble. Like, I say the most weirdest words. And I'll make, like, right now, like, for, like, the last month, I've been saying, don't be playing reindeer games with me. Or you're playing reindeer games, that means, like, you're fucking around, or you're playing around. Like, I'll take, I'll make my own bad words, pretty much, you know, for I can do my thing in front of the kids. You know, I can talk my stuff in front of the kids without cussing. Like, you know, like, I'll be saying, like, don't play reindeer games with me, you know? Like, don't, you know, don't be screwing me, or don't fuck with me, you know, like, that kind of stuff. Like, don't, don't be playing reindeer games. And I'll say that to the kids, don't be playing reindeer games with me, you know, so that way I can kind of cuss at the kids without cussing. Do you know what I mean? You know, and I just say, like, the weirdest things, like, it's so hard, because I can't even, like, come up with it right now, because, like, I'm trying to think of it, but, like, like, Nick's nay on the horse sleigh, or Nick's nay, or, you know, dash, or, Nick's nay, Nick's nay means, um, like, when my husband tries to, you know, fill me up around the kids, which I hate. Um, you know, he tries to, you know what I mean, you know, like, anything like that, I say next day on the horse, like, next day on the, you know, sleigh or whatever. I, I don't know. It's always next day on the hick sleigh or next day on, the, you know, something sleigh, you know. I always come up with, like, crazy stuff like that. Um, I have sayings for everything, like, I'm just weird, like, but reindeer games is, like, my newest word, like, and I've been using it, and I thought it would, like, run out of style since Christmas is over, but I'm still saying reindeer games, and I, I love that word, don't be playing reindeer games with me, I just love it, I'm addicted to that word, I'm addicted to it, and I know I'm a weirdo, but whatever, um, what else, um, I, I'm just, like, today, like, tonight, you know, I'm like, I'm the, I'm the boss, like, I'll just, like, come up, like, with, like, the crap, and I'll call my husband son, like, don't mess with me, son, like, I'm just ghetto, <laughs> I really am, I just come up, like, the most craziest crap, you know, I'm your boss, I'm the boss, because, I, I, don't, I don't know if you ever, like, if you guys ever ran into anybody that, like, if you're at a restaurant, like, there's so many times at a restaurant, and, like, the waiter calls my husband boss, okay, what can I get for you, boss, and I think it's, like, the funniest thing, and tonight this what happened, or what was it tonight, or was the other day? Someone called my husband boss, and I was just thinking of it today, and I'm like, I'm like, you know, I'm the boss. I'm like, I'm the boss of this house. Like, I'll just like, come up with like silly stuff, and um, I'm like, and you're you're the son. I'm like, you're, because <laughs> that's like an insult, you know, calling my husband the son, and I'm the boss. I don't. Know. We just mess around and call each other. Well, I'm always saying like off the wall stuff. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to think of like all the weird crap I actually say. I say freak nut. And I've been saying Freaknet before Samantha Sherman has said it, or, I don't know, before, but I said it, you know, before I start watching her, you know, so, yeah, Freaknet, I always say that, and I say, don't dazzle me, I say that, um, um, 
down. And then tonight I was singing, uh, cause I was, there's just, I don't know, it was last night I was thinking about how people sugarcoat everything, and I hate it when people sugarcoat, or they try to butter you up too. So I just made a random song saying sugarcoat and buttercream, you know what I mean? <laughs> like I just come up like, and I'll sing it in my freaking head. I was like singing like sugarcoat and buttercream, you know what I mean? Link cuisine? Like, I don't know. I'm really weird. But yeah, I just, I'm a weird, weird person. And my daughter's like, I am so lucky I have the funniest mom in the world. Like they think I'm just hilarious. I, I'm really hilarious. Like, I'm so hilarious. I, I'm not trying to say I'm hilarious, but I'm just thinking of the crap I do. Like, I am, I'm a weirdo. Like, I'm a serious weirdo. Like, when I wake my daughter up to school, <laughs> I'm not even going to say, like, I'm a creep. I'm a weirdo. Like, I'll be, like, looking at her, and for she screams and looks at me. Like, I'll be, like, even, like, the funniest look on my face, too. I'm not even going to be like, giving you, I make the funniest faces ever. And I'm too embarrassed to do that at this point. Um, but, yeah. Yeah. I'm really funny. Like, and then, like, all, like, like, my night-night pants I have on, like, I will, <laughs> like, the other day my husband was getting ready for work, and I was up, and I was, um, I have, like, these, those fuzzy night-night pants, you know, and they're too big, I got, because they were, um, on sale, and they only had, like, size large, so I bought them, bought them, and I'm gonna put it on, I, I literally put the pants all up on my shoulders, and he's, like, he just hell and start laughing, because I'm just a weirdo, like, I'm just doing cra craziest stuff ever, I've always been a really funny person. Um, I wish that I could come up with more words right now because I say some off the wall crap and I know after I'm done making this video, I'll say something, I'll, you know, I'll remember the thing I mostly say, but reindeer games is like the thing I say the most, Nick's name on the horse sleigh is like, you know, like don't be, you know, Nick's name, but I'll tell it to the kids too, like Nick's name, like shh, be quiet, you know, like don't say that or don't do that, you know, Nick's name on the horse sleigh, you know, that means like cut it out kind of thing. That means cut it out, yeah. So yeah, yeah. Do you guys have any weird little random sayings that you guys come up with, or do you guys play around and say off-the-wall stuff to your husband? And like, me and my husband can cuss at each other, and we don't get butt hurt. Like, we don't, you know? We don't get our feelings hurt at all. Like, we play around all the time with each other. Um, yeah. So, my family, maybe it's because it came from such a serious, serious non-funny family and maybe that's why I'm the way I am because I just I just have a really big sense of humor like I I don't get my feelings hurt by little things you know like I don't know I came from such a serious household and and they were allowed to make jokes and, and call me names but if I did it I'll get bitch slapped you know like not even joking <laughs> so yeah, so I think I just like having the freedom of saying what I want and doing what I want and being funny. And, yeah. So, like, when I was younger, like, this is, like, horrible, but my mom would not like it when I laughed. Like, she would, like, criticize me. Like, why laughing? What's funny? You know? And she would, like, turn it into something. Like, you laughing at me? You think I look funny? Like, I can never be happy. I can never... I can never be happy openly. I, I would have to hide my happiness if I was happy about something. And, no, I was never laughing at her. It was just, I don't know what was wrong with my family, but that's a whole other video, and I'm going to stop this video now, because I don't want to be a, a turd bucket and make this video longer than what it already is. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, it's kind of weird, I guess, kind of random, but hey, I'm really random too. So um, if I come up with any other words, I'll make another video and just tell you guys. Um, there are other words, I guarantee it. I just, when I'm put on a spot, it's, I don't work well like that. I really don't. I'm just, when I'm pressured, it's, you know, I'm not my best when pressured, but those are the ones I'm basically using all the time now, as far as what I remember. Um, I call Savannah, like, Pug. I'm like, Pugs. I always call her Pugs. Pug Bucket, Pugs. Um, yeah, I just, I call her a whole bunch of names. You know, Horse Reddish and... Spider pants. I, I call her. Whole, I call her anything. Like any little weird word, anything that she's doing. You know, like but pugs. She's my pugs. Like pugs bucket or just pugs. You know, and like 
strudel brains, you know, like when she's a strudel brains, like when she's being weird. I don't know, I'm really weird. Anyways, you guys, I'll let you guys go, because, yeah, I'm weird, and I'm very creepy. Not in a creepy way. I'm creepy, not in a creepy way, you know what I mean? So, yeah, anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.